It's not exactly the job description of a police officer, but one of them still ended up lassoing an alligator in Kendall today. That officer later told us he has not done anything like this before, but felt he had to do it to keep pets and people safe. He spoke about the wild confrontation to CBS4's Larry Seward, who has the story. One tail whipping alligator, six and a half feet long, weighing a couple hundred pounds, met his match in Kendall. Did you at all, when you step in front of that gator, think this is a bad idea? Of course. Absolutely. One day after a 10 foot alligator killed an 85 year old woman trying to protect her pet in Fort Pierce, this guy crawled past traffic into a field near Holmes and Kendall at Southwest 136th Street and 97th Avenue, where Miami Dade County police officer Manny Aroll often sees children on bicycles and small pets. Gator was looking at a brown cat that was by there, a little, little tabby cat, and the cat was just looking at the cat. And the gator was looking at the cat, and I was, well, you know, that's someone's pet. So a roll and two others and cruisers surrounded the reptile. At first, a roll stepped out and shrugged. Moments later, he grabbed rope typically used to pull officers to safety, made a loop, then tried tossing it around the gator's neck five times. I was like, I hope he gets it because uh, the gator was like far, but then it was starting to walk in my direction, like where I live. Finally, it worked. Even if a roll and neighbors wondered how long, it's a move he never tried. I just made a split second decision saying I got to hold this gator. I got to contain it. For most wildlife expert, Ron McGill recommends you call for help. It's a lot easier said than done. I know I have pets. Pets become like our children. But if an, a large alligator comes out and gets your pet, as hard as, as it is for me to say, you've got to let it go. Neighbors watching a roll saluted his work. He held the gator until wildlife officers took over and took the animal away. It's like he needs to be going to a uh, cowboy bar later on. According to a role, reactions from colleagues here range from way to go to you're crazy. But he says if he had to do it again, he would. In Kendall, Larry Seward, CBS 4 News Tonight.